Okay, you guys. So, we are on the way to try and eat at this Italian spot, Grana. See what happens. Um, so, I think when I left off vlogging on Friday, I was having such a hard time. Okay, so let me tell y'all what happened. Um, and we'll come back to my channel. <laughs> <laughs> um so i needed to i was running behind like i don't know what happened after i got my wax and everything but i was running behind there's a sidewalk and still you choose to be in the street you just got off work Kiki. i don't care the sidewalk is right there that's how people get hit oh they, oh. Got, they got the boat they finna go out to the lake oh mm -hmm. thank you Anyway, so I lost the AirPod again. I feel like the last vlog, I was just saying how I had gone to the Apple store and replaced my AirPod that I found. And I found a AirPod. Hey, superstar. I found an AirPod and then, but I have two right AirPods and no left. <laughs> so all right, whatever. It happened. So I'm gonna get another one. Then I, uh, it's probably in the car. I hope so, but I didn't see it. And it's like, I got an appointment tomorrow. So if I don't find it by 1.50 tomorrow, <laughs> it just is what it is. Like, I have extras. Um, Cause I got about four regular AirPods in my thing. I gave my grandma a pair of AirPods that I just had. None of them match? They match. Oh, okay. Well, I mean, they weren't from the same set, but it would be like, I lose them, then mm -hmm. find them later, but I'm already for a replacement. Or they, some of them don't really work that good either. Anyway, so I had the AirPods to park So then I go to the, um, I was like, well, I don't want to drive all the way over to the wax place and then they not have it. Cause I have somewhere else that I need to be. I'm racing the clock because it was supposed to rain and all this other stuff. So I was, and I needed gas. So remember my camera was overheating i think it died or something i was out of batteries i uh, used up all the batteries all day and so it was just a struggle right so i go to the gas station to get some gas something is wrong with the car so i open the thing and the little thing the flap that covers up your gas tank to keep gas from spilling like if you your car flips over or something that thing it wouldn't open so there's like two tiny little holes in it like naturally they're just they're just made like that so i had to take the gas pump and then let it trickle out and go into those holes it took me 25 minutes to pump half a tank of gas so what was messed up the holes or the tank the tank the flap cover on the tank oh um, so I was frustrated. So while I'm sitting there in the heat, I still had on that dress from when I, my, I go get my waxes in this dress. Sweat is literally dripping down my legs. And I was like, oh my God, did I start my period? Like it's dripping, dripping. No, it was just sweat. And I was like, oh, hell no. I know I'm about to be funky. This is not cute. So sweating and everything, trying to figure out the thing. I'm looking on YouTube, trying to figure it out the gas pump itself gets stuck so oh, hello i know so the gas pump gets stuck and it won't like stop letting the gas flow luckily it's going out slow but i was like now hold on i'm put my debit card in here so we don't need never ending gas so what am i gonna do so i'm looking around i because the flap is broken i can't just leave the pump there so i'm like where's the emergency shut off button where is um the call to speak to somebody inside button i'm not seeing none of this stuff and i'm just like this is too much i just need to go home and go to sleep i'm not Ugh. so i um I said, well, maybe if I take my hand, you know how it says replace the novel when my nozzle when finished. So I was like, if I replace, if I put something like hit the little flap on the pump, then maybe it'll think I put the thing back, it'll stop charging because that's what I was concerned about. Fuck a gas bill, excuse my language. Forget a gas bill and all the other stuff. Um, no. So. I was frustrated still and then I did that it worked but then y'all God said okay I'm done fooling with you today and was giving me free gas the gas just kept going it didn't stop so I said well we're just gonna sit here then I mean I already been out here all this time why not so it keeps pumping for a while and then I was like okay it's too hot I'm ready to go um and then the gas pump finally did shut off so then I just replaced the nozzle for real this time and went on by my business so I had broke my hookah the other day 
So I went to get another one because I really like that brand. Um, they didn't have the exact one that I had before. And the guy was like, well, what part of it broke? I was like, the bowl. He was like, the top bowl or the bottom bowl? I said, the bottom bowl. He said, the rest was fine. I was like, yeah. He was like, why didn't you bring it to me? And I could have fixed it. Then I was like, why didn't I think of that? I threw all that stuff away. Because I was just like, it. whatever. I would just need a new bowl. Because the rest of it wasn't broke. Oh, yeah. I didn't even think yeah, of it. That's but true. Whatever. And here go progressive. Okay. So that happened so i was frustrated because i didn't do that but whatever then i look over to my left I'm guess who i saw life. it was like seeing a ghost i said the, oh heck thing. no i saw that little um uh, man from the beginning of last oh, year you gotta tell me about how that went there was nothing to it this is it i <laughs> saw him and i said oh uh-uh, I gotta get out of here. But the hookah man, the hookah salesman, is taking all the, he just got a shipment of these hookahs in, right? I'm gonna put a link below so you can see what the hookahs are. But they were all pretty simple. They did look different. He was like, oh, this one's really pretty and I have these different colors. I personally like this one, I like this kind of bowl. He knocked on the bowls. I was like, I, don't give me no plastic now, I need glass. And um, he was is like- that Atlantis? Uh-huh. Okay. So he's like knocking on the glass. He's like, you hear how thick this one is and how much this one is? He's like, I'm gonna give you a good deal. I know he overcharged me. I don't even talk about it, but whatever. I'm not about to ha haggle with you because I see somebody who I don't want to see me. But I know that that somebody saw me. He had to. There's no way he didn't see me. So then I was just like over it and ready to go. Um, so I was probably there for another 20 minutes because I was gone for an hour. And those are the only two places I went. Um, and he was literally putting together these different hookahs. So I see the guy and he's sitting there and he's facing me. So I know that he <laughs> saw me. Eventually... Um, somebody comes over and was like hey this guy wanted you when you finished to um come over and uh catch up with him i said okay i got that shit so fast oh, excuse me i keep forgetting to not curse i got that stuff so fast and i was like dang i forgot to get the calls so he was like what kind of calls i said you know what never mind because i'm gonna have to pull my card out it's all right thank you i got some at home so then he was like oh i'll give you these free no worries okay cool and I had to go. Uh, so I left. And I was just like, I was hoping he had moved away like he said he was. But, <laughs> no. Hasn't happened. And then um, barbecue got caught in the rain. But the ribs wasn't done. So um, there was like this gazebo type situation. Covered thing. A little fire pit and stuff real cute so we just sat under there and let the ribs finish <laughs> and then it was just a little drizzle so you know it all worked out in the end because who wasn't about to have some uncooked ribs was me and i wanted my ribs okay it's people up there hopefully we can get a seat i see some tables um we are going to this italian spot called grana it's really good i've been quite a few times love it here um, what are you doing, sir? Right. Is there a reason you're driving so slow? Like, are you picking somebody up? He must be Ubering. I hate when people do that. Just be I in want, the way. Yeah. I want to sit outside and get some sun and enjoy the vibes on the roof. It's not 90 degrees today. The men are loving their man bags. I'm kind of jealous. Why? You can have a bag. <sighs> <laughs> you said you're jealous as if it's okay. it's weird for you to have a purse. Oh, I was supposed to put on my emergency nail. I'll take this. I'll they do all it in the bathroom. Yeah, they all have their bags. No, they're all closed. Y'all, yeah, I don't have any nails, oh. so I'm gonna go to the bathroom and put my nails on. Yeah, I heard you say emergency nail. I said, what the heck? emergency nail. Mm -hmm. okay. You brought your glue? Mm -hmm. Oh. Do we need a mask to go on? I don't know. If you do not have a mask, there's a box of masks down one. there. They be looking overwhelmed at the valet station. They really do. And I'm just like, why? The men do all have their purses. They do. So why does everybody, do y'all work for coach? They all got coach bags. That's what Raven just said. I'm him. Who's him, sweetie? Oh, they all are together. Yeah, and he got on the the feet. They probably do. 
Or they went to the outlet mm-hmm. earlier. Or the black one that's getting in the front seat, he definitely might work there. He like got the other. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, she got hers too. I mm-hmm. sure wish somebody would come service. Oh, I'm saying Hello. that. Hi. How are y'all doing? Good. How are you? Hi. All right. Okay, so we made it to Grana. It is upstairs on Piedmont. It's super cute. This is how it looks here. This would be a cute spot to come to, like, with a date, I think. Yeah. Although, y'all are always saying I forget to show you what I decided to wear. This is my outfit for the day. I'll try and get a picture for Instagram and get see the whole outfit in a pose. But I usually wear these like tan sand colored shoes. They're the exact same shoes that I have on. It's just like that color and black. Um, but they were in the trunk and then I decided to add a pop of color today instead. Um, so I really like that this look and I've worn a similar outfit um, multiple times so the jeans are Fashion Nova the t-shirt and the bralette that I have on underneath are Skims Summer Mesh it's Skims Summer Mesh and then the shoes I got from I think Public Desire um I got these cute little earrings from Target um yeah do y'all want like if i'm actually getting dressed because i'm still figuring this out if i'm actually getting dressed and stuff do y'all want me to like detail my outfit um like everything that i have on my makeup and all that because i can start doing that if you're interested but you might be like but she wears the same thing every day so we're good i don't know let me know what y'all think okay so i want to figure out what i want to eat here they have changed the menu and i need to get an instagram picture before i start eating because if i don't like who knows okay will you take a picture of me while we wait okay so i've got the meatball flight um this is the mommy uh -oh. this is the mommy's the pork with whipped ricotta on top, but they gave me like a little bit of whipped ricotta and they gave Tiffy like <laughs> so much. Um, but that's okay because I don't really want a lot of it. Then this is the Nona's. It has currant mustard on top. What and one? Currant, the one with the dark stuff on it. Okay. Then the next one is the Brass Town beef, which is one of my favorites. It has it's um, beef, of course, and then there's Gouda, and there's on top is this red onion and black truffle jam. And then uh, a little piece of good on top. This is the crispy veal with spicy mayo on top. And then this is the grana with uh, crispy sage on top. So they're all really good. And then we got the garlic bread, of course. Got a piece of Raven's broccoli. They both got um, the vodka Venus girl drink, whatever it was called. Super cute. Okay, I'm going to dig in. Okay, so we're done at Grana. We're about to go. Um, it's very hot out here. The service was not so great today, and they have taken a lot of my favorite things off the menu, so I probably won't be back for a while. We'll see what happens. I don't know. We'll see. But, hope you enjoyed Oh, this is a good angle. I keep trying to snap all the photos. Because I never know when they're actually going to, like, look good. If I'm just filming. It's like, you gotta stay still. I need to work on my thumbnails. 
and not use bye and <laughs> and not using like old videos but we'll see how it goes This girl just came out with her pit, and I just want to know, ma'am, this is an apartment complex. What are you doing with the pit? So, I decided to come to Big Easy Snowballs to get a little icy treat. Um, I like this place. I've been here a few times. I like that they're always here. They're open often so they're open they're open late on friday and saturdays but they close at nine o'clock during the week so like those are good hours and like the sliders all right they have a lot a lot of flavors have y'all ever had a snowball do you get them do you like them what do you think Blast. What is that? So it's mango and some other flavors. Okay. <laughs> What'd you get, Ray? Sour apple and wild cherry. Okay, so she's making mine. I got two foods. I got Bahama Mama, which is like tropical fruit flavors and coconut and nectar, which is a cherry almond flavor. Um, and then I asked for cream and double condensed milk because really I like a sweet sweet. If I'm gonna get a treat, I want a treat. Okay, so this is the final product. Yeah. Let's see. Yeah, this is it. So look at how cute it is. I love this place. I wonder if I need a mask. So we made it to the sushi place. Raven told us about another one that we're gonna have to add to the list. Um, it's pretty cute in here. Okay. This is our second restaurant of the day. I told y'all, we just love to go eat places. It's just like, at this point, it's what we do, you know? have ordered this it's really really good but it has it's also tequila cilantro Thai chilies which are super spicy with the salted rim maybe I'm tripping but the salted rim does not taste like regular salt it tastes like it's got a little flavor in there now we ordered a bunch of different stuff but they're out of things so they were saying that sundays and mondays are the days when usually they run out of things they get their food truck in on tuesdays so i think i would probably try to come on wednesday because you never know what time the truck is coming well i guess it should be here during the day because it's a dinner only place so this is what we ordered i'll show it to you when it comes out i just had to change my memory card what was that drink called that you got the day Okay, so Tiffany got the geisha, which is the rock pineapple, Malibu rum, and pineapple juice. And it has such a cute little flower that we should So this is mine. And that's hers. How cute, right? Um, Alright, so she tried to order the miso soup with snow crab, which I was considering too. She said they were out. Um, so then let's work our way down. I probably should have asked for the octopus too. Oh well. Um, we ordered the baked green mussels because they look so good on Yelp. But they are out of the baked green mussels. We did get the baked lobster tempura. So it says it's baked with Japanese mayo, eel sauce, masago, and scallions. Yellow tail. We got um, 
Perry is going to have plans. Because Perry is so excited when she finds out that the girls are coming to town. She's going to find something. I'll be like, girl, look now. My energy, you know, my energy be low now. I'm not turning queen like you. She can turn up. She be running and working out faithfully. Walmart girl, I'm gonna go to Amazon. You think I wanna go be in the store 
You know how I am. I hate to give it. Let me like, Then you search it for stuff. It's not where they say it is on the app. As long as we can. I'm not going to Austin until next week. So I got time for that. Even if it's a delay. Oh, I was looking at these for my niece. Oh, yeah. Ooh. I like, I like the, uh, mm -hmm. I was thinking, um, I was like, I don't know what I'm going to get my baby. The other girls are too old. This is what I was looking at. They got bikes and stuff. So I was like, do so I want to get my baby a Mozzie? Phoenix in the Mozzie? In the Lambo? In the G-Wagon? Or what? What else is out here? A Bentley? sister and see what her favorite color is. I'm gonna have to get the other girls like something else. But they love their little Fashion Nova outfits that I got them. That's what I need to do. We need matching outfits for Austin. See the girls' sizes. Can I get updated sizes on my No, you go ahead. I hate that I wasn't uh, doing it as well with my girls when they were younger. I couldn't buy them Bentley to be. But I, just, I need everybody to know. Somebody got to take care of rich auntie when she get older, right? So it's like, if I bought you your first Maserati, you have to take care of me. You cannot send me the shady kind. Now, Cause she got a bike. My mom's gonna be mad. My mom says I'm a one upper, and I was like, I'm not a one upper. It's just when I try to relate, you know. Sometimes my things are just above. She's like, whatever. You always be trying to outdo somebody. I don't try to outdo. It's just what I do. It's not on purpose. Is that for us? No. <laughs> Did you see that meme where it was like black people see food coming out of the restaurant? How they food come out before my end? Then the second thought is, is this place racist? <laughs> that's a black place, right? Exactly. I wonder if the waitress didn't really see it. Because that happened. All right, now, where's our next place? We didn't clear this out. It's looking real clear on here. Look at the table. I need to ask baby girl Sheila. What was her name? Oh. She's feeling, she seems a little flustered. With her, I'm so sorry. So y'all, after we leave here, I'm going to show Tiffany where this other restaurant is. There's a couple of cute restaurants over here that want our cute date nights. We're also cute girl nights because Um, maybe some of these son, if you raise a non trifling man, you know, and you're looking for a good woman, I cook, I clean, oh, wait, I'm lying, sorry, that just sounded good, I cook, I put out, <laughs> the cleaning, I, mollymates.com, um, I'm a business owner, I don't have time to be doing that. Fashion over sizes, girl. Why is she sending me these sizes? Giselle is a 14, 16. What is her fashion over size? Fashion over sizes. Because they got the, the little girl sizes, but um, Giselle, they, they don't have no four, 14, 16. You a small or medium. Giselle wears the same size as me, baby. Thank <laughs> you. 
are you singing the one? So the Kroger in Texas, near where we live, they have like a Chinese restaurant in there, and they have like the regular chopstick wrappers. They have instructions on the back. I don't use them like they say use them because they be like you use them and they say you move the bottom like your jaw, but I be moving the top like a jaw. I just stand this shit. And not nobody noticed. Hey, you just follow this shit. You just. Or you eat it. No one will know. They'll never know. They won't know. So whatever the little TikTok video said. Yeah, who's gonna know? It's not happening. So naturally, she'll need a new fit. Hater blocker. My sister said she really would be. I said I wanted to be a Phoenix this because, and um, naturally, she'll need like accessories. She's gonna need a new outfit. She's gonna need the hater blockers. She's gonna need the baddest bitch on the block. Yes. She said she really will be. Yes. Period. I figure out what to do to the other girls too. She said you already can't tell her shit. Okay. You really can. Yo, my niece is a character. She, this particular niece, is not coming on the trip. But I feel like Gianna gonna be like, shit. I can be the nigga. I want one too. Just Elle big enough to drive a car. She's still gone. I think she's going to sixth grade now. She's so precious. She's her big old cheese. This is my niece. Okay. Oh no, she might need the Maserati. That's a drop top. I mean, I can say all drop tops because it's kids. Cheapest. We're gonna see what the delivery dates are looking like. This man sitting over there, by the way, near the wire, Asian guy, you're gonna notice him. He looks like a character. I don't know if he owns the place, runs the place, or what, because I saw him walk right there. But he just looks like a character off the Dragon Ball Z. And he's just sitting there. Alicia, I would like another baby. I don't know because I thought the kitchen was closing, not the bar, and I'm seeing drinks being ordered at the bar. Because I want another one of these babies. So, y'all, um, I'm going to keep asking this for probably the next 30 days because. I'm just trying to get some feedback, figure out what y'all thinking, how we're feeling, um, what y'all want to see and stuff. You can make requests. Don't mean they'll be uh, granted, but you can make them. Okay, well, I guess I will preserve this battery because y'all know the battery's all out. Until the next round of food comes out. We've got more raw sushi and then we have some pasta. Because we have food fucked it up. Oops, my bad. Y'all. She's talking about, I'm sorry, I didn't even ask you what she was doing. I said, she talking about she was hanging in there. I'm like, what's going on? Oh, I'm just trying to hang on. I said, well, what's wrong? Oh, we done had a couple of deaths. I knew it was going to be some deaths. And I'm just like, I know you're not about to not ask me what I'm doing at dinner and then tell me somebody close to me is gone. So it is somebody I know, but not like a relative or anything. He passed away. But then at the end of the conversation, she's like, so I wanted to know 
when you write my obituary, girl, you got the ba yes, you got the background, you got all the ancestry stuff, you got the journalism degree. Can you write? I mean, of course I write for it, but girl, what? And her birthday coming up this week. Please stop cutting up. I don't know. Where is my dream? She did say, you want another drink? Yes, I was pointing. All right. Let me keep getting my kids. That's for y'all. I guess I should get some of it. I'm doing so much. I'm trying to be a YouTuber more consistently. It is hard. It's showtime at this table. <laughs>
Okay? I'm not going to be fucked with during those times. I had an attitude. My mama, I think I've said it on these videos at this point. My mom be like, oh, here she go. Here our sugar getting low. Oh, somebody feed her. She's nutting up on us. She's getting hangry and they make fun of it. But I'm just like, well, you do the same thing when y'all have your Coke Zero.
Right, nobody broke.